Hi guys, so today I'm starting the vlog kind of late. It's like 2 o'clock. I went to lunch with Joseph, who is my boyfriend, in case you, there's somebody watching this that doesn't know me personally. Um, and we, I didn't bring my camera. So yeah, we got lunch. We went to like this USC food truck thing that's near his place. And um, I'm probably going to be, this is really dark. There you go. I'm probably going to be vlogging over at least two days for this one because I'm not really doing much today. Didn't vlog yesterday because I really wasn't doing anything and I'm honestly not doing that much today. I'm probably going to be going to the office but it's a really pretty day. Um, it's like 60 something degrees. Or no, I bet it's in the 70s now. Good thing I can't hold a camera. Let's see. 75. Yeah, I don't know where I got 60 from. Good morning. It is the next morning. I did fake time last night and, um, but I didn't film it. I was just too tired and I got to bed really late last night. And because I ended up having homework that I didn't realize um, I didn't finish. Um, so I quickly finished that, that was fine. And then I was talking to Emily, who's my sweet mate. So we share a bathroom um, for a while. And so that took, usually I go to bed at 10. I have like cutoffs, um, eight o'clock. I can't work anymore, like no more work for school. Um, nine o'clock I'm ready for bed and then 10 o'clock it's be asleep and I have like reminders on my phone which sounds like insane but I promise it is the best thing I ever did um, but of course you know it's I'm strict about it but if things come up so me and Emily were talking for a while and I wasn't in the room at 8 o'clock which did not help I was at a meeting that I stayed after for to hang out and then my friend down the hall, her name is Scarlett, texted me and was like, hey, do you have your extra bed up? And we have two beds in this room, but I took one of the beds down and it's like, all its parts are like under my bed, which is really not pretty. I really should have been covering it, but I just don't right now. And I was like, no, do you need to sleep here? And she was like, yeah. And she told me something about a cover. So I told her to come. And there was a cockroach, like a really, really big cockroach that was crawling up the wall next to her head because her head was near the wall when she was like where she sleeps. And she tried to hit it. And like if you see this mirror right here, like it went behind the mirror and she was like, took a flashlight and was trying to get it out, but it never came out. And so she was really freaked out. So I let her sleep in my bed and then I went to my sweet mate's room and she's got like a couch. It's got like a bed mat on it or like a foam pad on it like under the sheet and everything and I just took blankets and slept there so it was fine. Um, it was actually very comfortable. So I'm about to go work out. really don't feel like it. My motivation is that I'm going to be watching YouTube videos while I work out. But I did fake tan in case you guys want to know. I use Loving Tan. Um, I've tried Saint Tropez. It's not bad. It's just I don't think it's as good as Loving Tan. I think a lot of people don't see the difference. I think Loving Tan dries faster. I think Loving Tan smell like you can't really smell it as much as Saint Tropez. Like Saint Tropez, you can definitely smell. Um, you get the same amount. I'm pretty sure you get the same amount, and uh, this is cheaper. And you can use like codes for this. So, like next time I buy this, um, I'll use Marissa Lace's code because you get a free tanning mitt, which is great. I need to get a new one because it's not, it's really gross. And then I use a Morphe M439, um, which is a foundation brush actually, but it got really, like I used it a lot and so it just got kind of not as good. And some of the bristles, like this is really old. And so I just washed it and I use this for my hands, wrists, feet sometimes. Face if I do face, I didn't do face. And my neck. 
and then anywhere else that I really need a buff in. Sometimes I do it on like my decolletage or whatever. But I really went for it. Like, I really went for it as far as like fake tan goes. I don't know if you can see. Like, I'm never good at the angle, so we're just gonna ignore that. So, whew, anyway, um, there's that. I'm excited to be self tanned, but I was not as careful as I was, or as I usually am. Usually, I'm very pretty meticulous about how to put it on and make sure I don't miss anything. And last night I was just like because I was so tired and I just wanted to get it over with. Um, but I love, I I do like self tanning. I was super skeptical about it, and then I got one for my senior prom, no junior prom, and then I loved it. And then I started self tanning when I got into college, and never looking back. Especially like spring break, I'm like, I was looking at my vlog for spring break and I'm so pale. So this time I'll be starting tan. I'll probably be more tan when I start spring break than when I leave because I don't tan naturally very well. And nobody wants sun damage. Okay, I'm going to stop procrastinating and actually work out now. Grandpa's coming today, so I'm just very excited to see him. So here's a quick thing of my outfit. Um, I got my red kids and then this, um, What's this called? Romper thing is from Loft. And then I've got my hair up and of course my little backpack and I am going to be late for class. So here we go. If you go. Lauren, how's your head? It's just great. What happened? It's a sad story. It is a sad story. It's actually kind of horrible. Um, you know, running along, minding my own business. Mm -hmm. um, my girl cuts me off. Yeah. She helps me. Bang. And I land pretty hard on my head. And she got a confession. But so, and then they stepped on her. Oh yeah, then they ran over. Yeah, that's the worst so, part. The fact that they had spikes spike on. Spike marks. Really? Yeah. really? Well, I won't. No, I can't lift my arm. Oh. I can't get dressed. I can't shower. Are you joking? Got a brain scan. Oh, yeah. okay. No. This is just a concussion. A cute, right? No. I feel like that sounds severe to me, your symptoms, but like, what am I doing? I'm not about this. Don't be in the arm. Yeah, only they one. didn't give me anything for afterwards, so you know. <laughs> That's a pretty one. Only one person. I mean, this is only one person, but that they would be on this committee. Is it Lael? It's probably Lael. Yeah, she hasn't gotten to her yet. I was crying at you two on this vlog. Oh my god, it's so funny. Huh? Do you want to be on the committee? You have to go that paper. You have to put your name on that. Just say no. Why is she in a bad mood? Okay, that's upsetting. I honestly have no idea what I have vlogged today. I don't think it's been a lot, but I'm about to, ooh. I was about to say I'm going to dinner with Grandpa. Who, Scarlett's calling me. Hello? Sure. I know I am. Okay, so um, that was Scarlett, um, my friend, and she needs me to go get her lab coat and her um, goggles for a lab and bring them to um, the science building. So I'm gonna run and do that. I'll go to dinner with Grandpa, and I think we're going to Mellow Mushroom, I think. So you like it? I do. That's good, I missed you.
take one about that sometimes, but I just want chocolate and sweet cream. Okay, so I am back from dinner with Grandpa. I had a fantastic time. He does come pretty much every Wednesday and have dinner with me, which is, I'm so lucky to have somebody like that. And we always have the best conversations. We went to Mellow Mushroom and got my favorite pizza. Ooh, oh my gosh, it smells so good. But we got a medium and even we could not um, finish a medium. And we had, let me close this box. That was a struggle. <laughs> um, so we got the medium and we also got, he tried the mushroom soup and we got, I'm trying to fade this in the fridge. What else did we get? Oh, and we got the spinach and artichoke dip, which was super, super good. And yeah, I had a fantastic time. And I think this, I'm just gonna end the vlog here. I haven't, um, I don't think I have a lot of footage. Just been some really chill time. I did wash off my fake tan, obviously. I don't know if I gave you an update on that. You can kind of see full body and try to be in the light. It doesn't really look like anything, I guess, um, from camera's view, but I did go pretty dark. Um, I don't know if you can actually tell or not, but um, it is pretty dark and that's fine because that's how I like it. And I blended pretty well. It's doing okay. Usually my ankles are a problem. My ankles look okay, even though on the camera I look like they were really blotchy, but they're not. Um, okay, so I'm gonna end it there, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.